Welcome to Ruhani Wellness Center. This is yoga dance. So let's get started. Come to your bridge position. We're going to start doing some bridges here. Making sure your neck is soft, the weight is in your shoulders, and you're pressing your heels down and back. Take your right leg up into the sky. Inhale. Exhale, lower everything down. Stretch your left leg, stretch your arms up. Exhale, come all the way up with that right leg up. Lower it down. Open your left knee. Take your left hand out and sweep your right arm forward. Come to a side stretch and crunch with your obliques. Lower all the way down. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, lower down super slow vertebra by vertebra. Take your feet in. Reach up with your right leg. Lower it down. Come all the way up. We're going to repeat this again. Open the left knee. Sweep your arm forward. Inhale, crunch. And exhale, lower your hip down, come all the way forward. Inhale, hands up, lower all the way down, vertebra by vertebra. Bend your knees this time, keep your right leg straight as you pulse up. And come all the way up. Sweep your right hand forward, crunch. And exhale, lower all the way down. Inhale, arms up, lower all the way down. Operation come in, left foot down. Right leg up, exhale, lower. Now take your heart up, come up, up, up with your heart. Inhale deeply, lower the right leg and stretch and crunch. Exhale, lower all the way down. So the trick is you keep your right leg straight all the time. Now in a float two more times. Exhale, lower all the way down. Left foot, right leg up and inhale, come up with your chest. Your right leg is always straight, lower it to the floor, open and crunch. Come all the way down. Inhale, hands up. Last one, lower vertebra by vertebra. Left foot flat, right leg up. Inhale, lower, heart up, heart up, leg straight. Lower your right leg, open the left, sweep and side crunch. You got it. Time to do the other side. Lay down on your back, vertebra by vertebra, feet flat on the floor. Let's do some bridges here. Hands flat and lift up and lower. Again, make sure you're pressing your heels down and towards you and you're lifting with the glutes and the back of the leg. The weight is never on your neck. Lift your left leg up into the sky, exhale, lower. Press your right foot away from you. That's also going to help you come up, keep that left leg straight. Lower it down, inhale, open up, side crunch. Now we did this on the other side, you've got it. Inhale, up, exhale, roll down, vertebra by vertebra, stand back. Bend your right foot, lift your left leg, inhale, exhale, lower. Stretch the right leg, crunch up, lower the left leg, open the right knee, and side crunch. Let's do that a few more times. Inhale, come up, exhale, vertebra by vertebra, lower down, stretch your arms back. Left foot flat, right leg up. And exhale, lower. Stretch the left foot, push it away from you, inhale, come up, come up, come up. And again, remember, the trick here is you're keeping that left leg straight all the time. That's what's going to keep you from not getting confused. Two more times. Lower down. Inhale, lift the left leg. Exhale, lower. Press away with your right foot, come up. Lower the left leg. Open up, make it feel good and side crunch. Exhale. Take your hip down and stretch forward. Inhale deeply. Exhale, roll down vertebra by vertebra. Last one. Inhale, left leg up. Lower all the way down. Stretch your right leg. Come up with the chest this time. Push that foot away from you. Open it up. Inhale. Exhale, side crunch. And exhale, lower all the way down. Inhale up. And exhale, roll down, vertebra by vertebra. Stretch back, inhale deeply. Take your feet flat on the floor, hands down. Tuck your tailbone, inhale up for a bridge, exhale lower. So we're going to sculpt the body and prepare it a little bit more. Lift your left leg up, exhale, cross the foot over the right knee, inhale up, exhale, cross. Inhale up, exhale, cross. You're coming up into a bridge, never touching the floor. Inhale, come up. This time, lower the left leg straight. Open it up. Inhale, up. Lower the left leg. Open it to the side. Close and up. Lower. 
side, close and up. Lower, side, close and up and lower all the way down. Other side, right leg up, exhale, cross as you dip, inhale up. Cross as you dip, inhale up. Make sure both hips are square. Inhale up, exhale, cross and dip, inhale up. Lower the leg straight, open it to the side. Inhale, bring it up and pulse. Lower, open, bring it straight up, pulse higher, lower, open, straight up, pulse higher. So two different ways of doing that. Open, you can also come back and then pulse up. Lower, open, close, and then pulse up. Lower the right foot down, inhale, stretch all the way, huge breath in. Exhale, curl up, vertebra by vertebra. Inhale, reach up with your hands to the sky. Exhale, lower your hands down and twist. Inhale up, now twist to the other side. Inhale, come back. Now open your right knee, right hand on the floor and come to the side. We're gonna pulse the left leg up. So making sure you're pulsing from the glute and the outer thigh. Pulse a little bit more. Take the left foot flat and stretch that right side of your torso. Inhale, come back to center. Now we're gonna take it into side crunches, root down through your left foot. And now we're crunching with the left obliques. So you pulse up and lower, up and lower. Make sure you're really using those side abdominal muscles. A few more, up. Inhale, reach the hands up. Take the right hand on the floor. And now we're gonna crunch and we're gonna pulse the leg up and the arms in, so we're using the entire side body, crunching it in. Again, your tailbone is long, your ribs are in to protect your low back. Let's do the other side. Open up your right foot, stretch, and inhale. Let's just pulse the leg first. So pulsing through the outer thigh, your right leg, using the glute, and lower the right foot. Inhale, stretch through that left side body. Make sure you're tucking your tailbone. Come back to center. Now take it to the left and crunch to the right. And crunch. And crunch. Really making that core strong. Every time you exhale, you crunch. Mm -hmm. Make sure you're keeping your jaw relaxed. And you're done. Take your left hand down. And now we're going to crunch both the leg and the torso. Here is super important. You're tucking your tailbone, keeping your low back really spacious. So it's a side crunch. It's not into your low back. Now inhale, open it up, stretch here, and come back to center. Give it a little drama, huge breath in. Exhale, lower. Inhale, both hands up, stretch. And exhale, lower. Now let's even out our body. So coming into kneeling, tuck your tailbone, keeping your ribs in, hands to your hips or un interlace your fingers behind your back. Roll your shoulders back a few times, creating space, tuck your chin back. Stretch your arms, stretching your heart up into the sky and lifting that spirit higher, huge breaths. Remember, make it feel good. Hands on the floor. Push back into your down dog and paddle in place. Getting length in your low back and the back of the legs. Making it feel good. Walk your feet forward and just dangle here in ragdoll, moving from side to side. Releasing the tension in your low back. Inhale, roll up, vertebra by vertebra. Now the body's super warm. We can put it all together and do this move again. So you can try this with me, it's the same thing we've been doing, we're just going to dance it a little bit more, putting a little bit more drama to it. So you lead up with your chest, and when you come to the side, you throw your arm. So let's watch that again. You lead with your chest, throw your arm, throw it up, other arm, and lower. It's a little bit faster, it's a little bit more dramatic, it's a little bit more fluid, and then you get that added dance effect to your yoga routine. Hope you enjoyed it. Have fun.